Hello there guys, I'm the Game Surfer and welcome to Temtem's episode 3 now. So, where did we leave off? Uh, so we are, uh, we just left Zadar, the starting zone, we are in the middle of the Prasine coast, or Prasine coast, actually, I'm not sure. And uh, hopefully today we are going to reach the next area, I think it's called Rihal del Mar, it should be up here. So, let's begin. We already fought this trainer, so... Should we check this area? No treasure? Oh. I thought it might be someone to give you a quest or something, not a trainer, but... The flag. It's messy, too high. We still haven't caught any, any additional Temtem, so I'm definitely looking to do that today. Let's see, let's go back. Windblade on this. I think Cypad should be a water type, so Windblade doesn't look like it causes extra damage. Maybe I'm not. <laughs> well, that's actually quite damaging from someone who's like four levels below, five levels below. Uh, let's go to your voice. Tawai has like a trait that causes 25% more damage when you use. Uh, Area attacks. Oh, damn. It doesn't. She didn't attempt to summon the other character. It's too bad. Keep going. Kiki? Cute. Uh, let's, let's, let's. Let's just kick. Suck up. Contest for now and let's back there. I'm running low on mana points or. Uh, whatever you call the blue bulbs. On two eyes, so might need to rest in this turn, but it, ooh, Smuzzy is out. That's not too good. Um, let's just keep using pack for now. I'll damage myself, but I should end the fight, so I'll just go back to heal quickly. Right, fight number one down. Sure, okay, don't need it. Sure. Okay, let's go quickly to. Oh, damn it. Kaku. I heard this. This. Um, Temtem is actually quite good, so I might actually try capturing now. Apparently, some people. Post him as the strongest Temtem in the game. I was looking forward to to, me, to encountering him. I just didn't think it would happen as uh, my main Temtem was out. Okay, let's hit him one more time with back, and then I think we can show our uh, our Temtem card. What do they call it? I forget. I'm trying really hard not to call it Pokemon. Temp card. Oh yeah, see, I'm right. Okay, let's see. Is it Theo? Perfect! We got Kaku, our first... Uh, okay. Our first uh, Tam Tam caught in the wild. Okay, he definitely needs to catch up on experience, so let's put him in the team. Oh wow, look at that one. But Tam Tam is quite... Impressive. I think it's called uh, Oshiara. Oshiara. It's uh, it's a pretty rare. Uh, it's a pretty rare uh, Temtem. So we should be encountering it soon if, if we stick around and grind it. This is the wrong way. It's like a broken bridge. Uh, just go through here. I saw a chest there. So, oh. Top of the morning to you, fellow man. Top of the morning. I'll uh, jet skeptic eye style. It's a great time to be outdoors, enjoying the sea breeze. It's not the most cars, I need to get tripping. Oh, it's time time. Every time. Sure. Ah, yeah, we forgot to put Kaku in the team. Okay, we'll do it after this fight. So, Kington Town. Okay, we won't do it now. Just want to get done with this fight. Quickly. Uh, 
Martial Strike, and Break again. Should be it. Yeah, perfect. Almost level 10. I wonder if the gym is in the next town or if we need to wait longer. I've actually played through some of this before, but I really don't remember. Okay, looks like there's another turn here. Okay, fights are actually quite... Uh, do happen quite often. Oh, Winky, so two... Uh, electricity types. I still forgot to, to cut you in the main team. What the hell? Okay, let's just go. Let's just level 5 though. Let's just your void. Just... After this fight, I promise to myself I put Kaku in the game. Arcs. What does this do? Oh, special attacker. Sure. This should be enough. Perfect. Okay, okay. Let's swap. Uh... Ooh, but I got them. Uh... Perfect. Okay, let's put Kak in the, in the first team. Uh, let's put him for uh, two Y so we can level Smazzy as well. Oh, Totero. I actually heard a good thing about Totero too. Apparently it's useful. Oh, but this one is just level 3. Mm, okay. I don't wanna... I don't feel like leveling him up, to be honest. So, let's just get rid of this one. And if we encounter a new one, another one later, we can uh, level him up. Okay, we poisoned him. Probably end him here. Yeah, perfect. Oh, sense blocker. Perfect. Okay, let's go. Another fight. Ah, oh, damn it. There's so many. I'm gonna fight, I'm gonna fight. The... what was this called? Piranian? Oh, Piranian, yeah. Level 11. That's actually quite... Uh, that's higher than both of my guys. Ooh, so Sand does increase damage to this guy. Good to know. Poison aim. Alright, uh, shell mark. Shell strikes and uh, shield for now. We should probably put out Kaku for now because this is gonna happen. Indeed. Okay, well, 2i comes in now. Hopefully, especially to it. Let's try this new attack, Feather Gatling. Cost a lot of mana, so it better be good. And then let's continue with Toxic Sports. Let's try a beautiful graphic. And it worked out perfectly. Oh, Kaku got a new attack. Really good training, then time can we come. Never mind, it's just a status alterator. Oh, but he got so much experience. Okay, do we... Should we revive our Tam Tam? Probably not yet. Are we close to the next area? We don't seem to be too far, so maybe let's just hold out. I don't want to waste resources. I'm one of those guys that, yeah, I'm not going to use the resources and then... But this looks like a fight. Okay, maybe we should. Let's just revive him. Uh, sorry, wrong screen. Let's go backpack, revive, see, and this is a Okay, let's go! Yota! Oh, 
All right, that's fine. But we should be close to break out of mire now. Oh, I think this is Kaku's evolution. Saku, is that possible? They look alike. Uh, this is his pores. Oh, that really did not work. Another interesting thing about this game, um, I can't show it to you yet, but many Temtems have uh, combat attacks, so if they are in on, on the battlefield with someone of a certain element, their attacks have extra effects. I don't have any Temtems that can do that right now, but as soon as I do, I will point it out to your game. Uh, you see. It's quite an interesting dynamic, I think. It, uh, it's interesting once perhaps there is a competitive scene for these games or people are playing it online and there's a huge war more than times. It'd be interesting to see which combinations uh, people come up with. I still strike to damage. Because we're gonna damage ourselves. Let's use Nimble. Okay, just so it does do damage. One out. The trait, uh, Kaku's trait coming in handy. Can be poisoned, so let's use a strike. And toxic orbs again. Just close. Yeah, this should be close. One thing I do remember from this game that sometimes it's quite um, you need to farm your levels up because uh, uh, the gym leaders are so strong compared to you. So you need to have to. Go back, find any trainer you can, and uh, uh, find any trainer you can fight against uh, wild temptams, so you can get the experience to beat uh, the gym leader. Uh, do you know I've met uh, Arisoda? Okay. Doesn't matter, does it? Battle, battle. Okay, two flying types. I don't have anything they're weak against, so I guess we'll just use our basic attacks. Barak is level 11, damn it. Okay, let's try and take him out. Sure, 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 sure. Pokemon I ever played was Ruby? That thing? Oh no, maybe I played some of the ones afterwards as well. Well anyway, what I'm getting at the, the graphics compared to this game to those games are so much better. But it's also true that a new Pokemon came out recently, Sword and Shield, I think it's called. And I haven't checked that out. I know there are the mega Pokemons, which look quite epic, if not a bit silly, but a lot of Pokemon's graphics are as good as this now. I haven't been able to check. Okay, alerted. That's what the exclamation mark is. Uh, let's use the strike of Parag. Uh, I mean, we can't really do much else with... I guess this doesn't do much. Let's just use... Side Shield. In case they try to take our Kaku, so that we make sure we get the experience. Tell us what it is. Okay. Got a Ooh, okay. Urushaw. Okay, so this is one of those attacks that I was telling you about. As you can see, uh, so it does damage, 41, and cost 8 uh, stamina points, is that what it stands for? 
so if you have a toxic ally, it also poisons the enemy for turns. Uh, unfortunately, we do not have a toxic ally, ally but um, it's quite a powerful um, move, so let's try out. Let's see the graphic as well. The graphic, the... the well, you know what I mean. The fact. Okay. Well. Uh, is this the village? No more fights? Yes. Okay, we reached the village. Aha, what took you so long? Hmm. So if you want to catch the airship, I have to rush to solar right now, otherwise I'll have to wait for the narwhal. Nair it needs extensive repairs. Don't worry, Prof. Constantinos, I understand. Do that, my friend, I'll take care of the kids. <laughs> Thank you so much, Sophia. Oh, you won. Bring the me next time you come to Arbury. Mm -hmm. Aha, I shall hold you to your work, Professor. But I see your youngest disciple has arrived. Oh. Right on time, TGS. Please let me introduce you to my good friend Sophia. She's the dojo master of our soul. <laughs> Hi kids, how are you? I'll be giving you a little tour of Brihal Mar before I drop you off the academy. Kids, this is where we part. My ship sails in an hour, so I have to rush. I'll leave you in the capable hands of Sophia. Oh, get out of here, Constantinos. You miss your flight. Bye bye, <laughs> Constantinos. Uh, very well, follow me, friends. See? The little shop here is uh, Louis Souvenirs. It stocks all sorts of knickknacks for mm. tourists. It's a good place to get your first Themesons vial. No apparently you should go without one. So save up and get it as soon as you can afford it. Okay, this way now. Oh yes, Themesons vial is the... Um, mm -hmm. it, it allows you to heal like if you were at a center while you're in the middle of like going up a mountain. It's quite useful. Indigo Lake, always so peaceful. Some days, when the Silado River is too crowded, I came here to surf a bit and trim my water tanks up. Because you can train your water tanks only in water, right? And this big building here is your academia. It's managed by associate teachers from my dojo. Okay, that's where I'm going, the, to the dojo. <laughs> One day, Max, when you're ready. For now, all new apprentices come here to learn the basics. Once you're probably trained, you might go... You might join my dojo in Arizona. Mm. No buts. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is where the Temporium. Mm. So this is our local Temporium. There's one of these in every major town. It is we tamers come to heal our Temtem -tem and buy Temtem -tem stuff. <laughs> I love you. Oh, you'll ever need them more. So it's always a good idea to pay them a visit as soon as you arrive in a new town, okay? Mm. That way are the Talassian Cliffs and the route up to Arisola. It can be dangerous, so never go that way without a adult. We are adults, and the dogs are that way. I could spend hours just sitting there, feeding the water, watching the Pansam turn the Silado River into golden fire and pastel on things. Pastel <laughs> things, so. And that's it. This is our little Brical del Mar. I hope you Brical del Mar. Okay, I've been saying Brical del Mar until now. I hope you make lots of friends and enjoy your stay. Mm -hmm. Just starting now, kids, and I have to get back to the dojo. If you are having another spot, drop by the dojo and say hi, okay? Very well, then. Have a great day. See you, Sophia. Mm -hmm. uh, you heard her, TGS. I bet I can blaze through Academia faster than you. She said, come visit me uh, at the dojo one day, loser. Okay, well, let's go heal our Tam Tam, first thing. And uh, I think this is a good spot to... And episode 3, we made it to Brica del Mar. Um, we had uh, quite a lot of fights. We caught a new Tem Tams, Kaku. Uh, we, next episode, I think we'll get around Academia and see up to where we can reach. Prob looks like there is some content we, we need to unlock at this uh, uh, in this place. So, let me know what you think of my Tem Tams, what you think of Smazzy, Kaku, and Tuai. Is that his name? Uh, see you tomorrow for part 4, remember to leave a like and subscribe, and see you soon!